guys welcome back to my channel forever clean today i'm going to show you a few cleaning products that i got from the dollar tree and i got some from the dollar general and also i'm going to show you a radon haul i've been collecting these things over the past couple of weeks or so and some of the things some of those things are like Easter decor or whatever, but they was on sale. So I thought I'd just go ahead and buy them to decorate for next year. So that's what I'm going to show you today. And it's just a collab of Easter decor and other um, new Radon products as well that I want to share, you, share with you as well. So I'm inviting you today back to my channel and I hope you enjoy. And the first, what I'm gonna start out first with is just the, the, pro, the cleaning products that I um, use in my home. Um, regularly on a regular basis so I'm going to show you that as well okay so let's get started um, I got this product right here it's called the Fabuloso and I got it from the Dollar Tree and it's all the products from the Dollar Tree are a dollar obviously so um, this is one of the products that I got and I use this to mop the floors with clean the bathrooms with or clean the walls or whatever so it's actually a really really good product you have to excuse me today. Today is a really, really um, nice day. I just got off from work, so I decided I'd just go ahead and film this video. So I um, took uh, took my makeup off and got all relaxed. So we're just gonna go ahead and do this haul, okay? Um, so I may look a little tired. So I, I just got off from work. Um, this is an Ajax product. I use this product to wash dishes with or I'll actually usually clean out the bathroom with and bathtub, sinks, whatever, the walls or whatever. So it's actually a very good product as well. And this is the Ajax. And I got this from Dollar Tree. And um, I have the blue Ajax. It's like a it's like a mental purpose cleaner. You can use this. It says fresh bathroom. You can use this in the bathroom or you can use it anywhere. But most I use this in my bathroom because it has like a fresh scent, um, but you can use it any way you want to, but it says like fresh bathroom. So I guess obviously you're supposed to use it in the bathroom, but we don't always go by directions of cleaning products, do we? So you can use this in the bathroom or the kitchen, wherever you want to use it, but it's actually a very good product. And I actually love this. This is one of my favorites here. So I suggest you pick you some up. And this right here, this is the Comet. Um, the Comet two times cleaning power with bleach. And I keep this right by my sink at all times. I try to, except when my husband tries to take it in the bathroom and clean out the shower wig. But I actually keep this by my sink at all times. And I actually, um, whenever I get through washing the dishes at nighttime, I scrub it out with soap. And I use this to scrub it out as well. If it's like really, really, if the sink is really, really greasy or whatever, and it's really, really cuts the grease. And I got this product from Dollar Journal, and I think it was like a 125 or so but it's actually a very good product my daughter is assisting me today so i'm giving the products over to her on the other side of the camera <laughs> she waved a little hand inside the camera actually this is another um ajax what i just showed you i actually got i actually got um four of those but this is another um ajax um like dish soap whatever so i actually got four of those so that's why i'm pulling them out give it to my daughter on the side and this product right here, this is called Ultra Concentrated, I can't sell those, that big long word, Ultra Concentrated Dish Liquid Detergent. I buy this all the time. Um, I actually use this in my bathroom. I don't use it um, to clean out the dishes with. I use this in my bathroom to clean out the toilet, clean the floors, clean the walls, clean the bathtub. And it's actually a very, very huge bottle. So I actually like that, that you get this much product that you can um, clean your bathroom with. So it, it does not do a good job cleaning the dishes because it does not like cut grease really, really well. I don't think so. I actually never tried it on my dishes, but I just assumed it. It says advanced cutting grease formula, but I've, I've been buying this for a while cleaning the bathroom with this, but I have not actually tried it on my dishes. I guess I should since you get so much of it, but I usually buy about two or, two or three of those, these, at a time, I usually keep these on hand to just clean out my bathroom. Okay. Um, next is a, this is a, I got this from Dollar Tree. This is a professional foam carpet refresher. 
no vacuum needed. And I use this, you can spray this in your car or whatever. I mostly use this in my son's room because he, this is um, my son's room and my daughter's room. It's the only rooms in our house that has carpet. So I use this to spray on their floors to freshen up the carpet. Even though we don't wear shoes in the house, so, you know, they do sometimes have a little bit of odor or whatever. So I usually um, freshen up the carpet. Then after it dries, you can vacuum it up as well. But I usually get this from the Dollar Tree. And I usually buy about two or three, two or three of these at a time. So I actually like this. Um, you have probably um, saw these around. This is Moisture Eliminator. Um, it controls moisture. I usually put this like where your air condition, your air condition vent is or your air conditioning closet. I put this in there and it absorbs the the moisture in the air. So once it gets so full of water, I usually just throw it out and get another one. They only cost a dollar. And I actually put this above my stove as well. And actually, like when your vent is on, you're cooking and you're boiling water and cooking food or whatever, this actually absorbs the moisture in the air or whatever. And actually, I keep one in the laundry room and I keep one on top of the refrigerator and it does actually, it does a very, very good job. I think it does. So I suggest you try this. And of course, I bought two of these. I usually buy two at a time. Sometimes I buy four, but today I only needed two. So only about two um, just to put in my um, air conditioned closet and put above the stove. So these are good. And I get these from Dollar Tree. Um, the next two products are how y'all say this? Suave, suave tail, suave tail complete. I guess suave tail complete. That's is what this is. Is suave tail complete? It's like a with stain shield technology. It's like a fabric softener. And every time I get ready to wash the the bed sheets or whatever, I actually use this. And I actually just use the whole bottle whenever I get ready to put it in the rinse sack or whatever. And it actually smells really, really good. So just give this a try and I really like this. Uh, and of course I get these from the Dollar Tree. The next product I have is Ammonia. Ammonia. Now you guys heard of this? Do you guys use this? I don't know if you guys use this, but I was raised up using this product. Ammonia. Is that how you, I guess that's how you say it. Ammonia. Okay, let me tell you a little bit about this product. This product you could put it in your mop water. You could put it in your towels. You could put it in your bed sheets. You can clean just about anything with this product. And what I do with this product is I clean the floors or I clean the bed sheet or put it in the laundry, I mean in the washing machine to clean the bed sheets or whatever. Actually does a very, very good job. So, but it says like clean your bathrooms, clean sinks, windows, garbage pails, like your garbage cans, ceramic tile floors, or anywhere. But I was raised up mostly using this for like your towels, when your towels get really, really musky. You know how it can sometimes happen. Your towels can get really, really musky and you need a little bit reinforcement to get that stink out of them. So try this, it will work. I'm telling you, don't, don't, do not pass up on this. Use it. Very good. Okay, this is the, the next two products are actually one of my favorite products that I keep in my kitchen at all times. I usually keep it up under my sink so it's like easily for me to pour into my cleaning bottles and it's easily for me to pour in the mop, mop water or whatever. And this is the pine saw. And this is the, uh, on my first cleaning video, I gave me a cleaning video the other day and I talked about the purple pine saw. This is it. And I actually put this like in a spray bottle. Um, I'm gonna um, Carlisha, go get the spray bottle, Carlisha. I actually put this in the spray bottle and I, you know, fill, fill the spray bottle up half with pine saw and the other half with water. And this is one of the bottles I put this in. I fill it up like about this much with half with pine saw and the other half with water. And I usually can't clean this on my first video that I did with you guys here on YouTube. I usually fill this up um, up with, you know, this pine saw in here. And I usually keep this on the sink, by my sink in my little cleaning caddy. And I spray that in the sink, um, in the sink, the stove, whatever I need to clean, this cleans just about anything. 
So I usually keep this on hand at all times. And I also keep this on hand at all times. And I also use the brown, you know the brown scent, like the, the brown color one, like smells like pine trees or whatever. That's good too, but sometimes I get sick of using that, that brown kind. I want like a, a good smelling, fresher kind. Also, you can buy like the yellow kind, but right lately, these have been my two most favorite ones. The Sparkling Wave and the Lavender Clean. Very, very good. I, I like these. Try them. And you get a big bottle. It's like very, very huge. It's like 48 fluid ounces for $3 from the Dollar Journal. Not from the Dollar Tree, from the Dollar Journal. Try them. Okay, the next, I think I have like about two more cleaning products left, I think. Two more cleaning products and then we're gonna get into the Rayon haul, okay? Um, the next product I keep is the Windex. And I actually um, do not keep this in this bottle. It's called, you should get my Windex bottle. It's over there on the sink. I actually don't keep this in the bottle to clean with, I mean to spray this directly from that bottle. Yes, I actually spray it in another bottle like a, um, it's called, I get this bottle from Grove Collaborative. I order a lot of pro, a lot of my cleaning products from Grove Collaborative. So I just save the bottle, and the bottle really, really sp sprays really, really well. It just looks nicer on my sink than this. So I usually take this out of here and pour it in here, and I write on there with a, with a Sharpie marker so I know what it is, just in case my husband grabs it or my oldest son grabs it, even my 10-year-old, or uh, my 11-year-old now. She just had a birthday. If she grabs it and I tell her to go clean the sink, I mean go clean the window or the front door or the mirrors or whatever, she would know that this is Windex and I need to write it again because it's not faded off. So um, I usually pour it in here and this, I mean I pour this in here and just keep this in this bottle. This looks much nicer and cleaner on the sink in my little cleaning caddy. And I'm gonna show you my guys, I'm, sh I'm going to show you guys my cleaning caddy on my next video, how I organize things. Um, where my sink area is. I just keep things right there nice and neat so I can have things handy whenever I need to clean with, okay? But I get this from the Dollar Journal. And I think it's like about 325. Very good. And this product is, don't you guys rest on this either. One of my favorites. Um, I think about, about I think we go through about four of these a month because I use vinegar, distilled white vinegar. You can get this just about anywhere, Walmart, Dollar General, just about anywhere you can buy vinegar, even the grocery store. So I usually use this um, to put in my spray. I got a cleaning bottle that I keep in the bathroom and I'm gonna show you guys that in a, in a later video. I fill half with vinegar and I fill another, um, I fill another half with dome dish soap and I fill the other half with pine salt and it's like a cleaning solution which I keep um to wash out the bathtub or I wash out the just about anyway the floors or anywhere I need to clean so I usually keep that nice and handy but do not sleep on this this is actually a very very good product I actually love this very very much so try this um my husband just told me to pick up some more today and I picked some up you know, because he wants me to make some more cleaning solution for the bathroom area. So that's what I'm going to make, okay? But do not um, rest on this, buy this, and you can use it in your laundry and you, whenever you get to wash your towels and keep your towels nice and clean, it will actually help cut the odor and cut the, the must out of the towels. But we actually love this very, very much. My um, husband suggested I buy another bottle today, so that's what I did. I actually bought two, so we won't we won't run out so I can refill those cleaning spray bottles for those bathtubs. So next, I'm going to get into the Ray Dunn haul. And um, I want to go ahead and get this haul done because my husband has been on me about buying these little things, but you know, we buy things in our life these days that makes us happy, right? So it makes me happy. But actually, we went on a shopping trip the other day for my daughter's birthday, and we went shopping, and I took her shopping. My husband took her around to the stores and let her buy things as well. So then my husband was like, 
You don't need no more items. You don't need no more Ray Dunn items. Where are we going to put them? But, of course, I talked him into it and he let me buy a couple of Ray Dunn items. Of course, I got a few other items when he was not with me on the on the shopping trip that me and my daughter went to. So, we got some more um, items as well. But, um, like I told you before, a lot of these items are like Easter decor that I caught on sale that I'm going to decorate with next year. I don't just... I, I don't just decorate with my radon. I actually use my radon. I actually drink up my coffee cup. So I actually um, use my canisters. So I show you a, a lot of how I decorate my radon in future videos. Okay, but I'm gonna start with a the coffee cups, and my daughter is gonna assist me in this pro, um, process. She's behind the scenes and she's doing a good job. Okay, this is like um we're gonna do like the Easter. Um, this is not really Easter, but I I tell you when it's like an Easter. Um, mug or whatever, but I like this one right here. This is like be in the moment, and it's like a um, be in the moment mug or whatever. And it's green, it's like a matte green, I guess, but it's pretty. I like it. So, I, 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 I try to pick out the mugs that's like make me happy, like the words that really, really make me happy in the moment or the, in future moments the, the, um, from day to day that I'm going to look at, and th that really, really makes me happy when I use these um, items in my home. So this one really, really spoke to me. Be in the moment. So we really have to be in the moment sometimes to enjoy just the little things of life. I think we do. So I really like that one. This next mug is like a, I guess it's like just recently came out for, um, from her Ray Dunn, I mean from Ray Dunn, the collection, but it's like a Bumble B mug and it says Bumble. So I was gonna decorate this for summer and do on my little tray, I mean my little shelf on my kitchen counter and just decorate this and I actually like this it's like bumble bumblebee okay so I enjoyed it. I'm going to enjoy this one as well okay um my next mug is beautiful day this is like white all over and it has yellow right here and it has yellow on the inside Can you see that beautiful beautiful day <laughs> you you know this one spoke to me. This one spoke to me a lot. Beautiful day. Every morning I wake up and say, can, can we can we have a beautiful day? Yes, we're going to have a beautiful day. We're going to have a good day. We're going to have a lovely day. They should make everything say beautiful day, good day, lovely day, happy day. Every kind of days. I like this. So I got that one as well. Um, and I hope Carlicia is putting them in order so I don't redo myself. But hopefully she do a good job. Um, next one. It's Boss Mom. I got this in all these products. Um, I basically got from like Home Good or TJ Maxx or whatever. And this is like Boss Mom. And this is like really, really good um, quality. And I think I paid like $9.99 um, $9 for this. And I guess like all the other mugs that I showed you previously, of course, they are $5.99. If you have watched anybody Ray Dunn haul, of course, they are $5.99. But of course, things like this, the, the topper, mainly they are actually $7.99 or $9.99. But I thought this one was pretty. You'll see mostly the things I buy, like for the Ray Dunn, I usually buy something with mom or a meaningful or a good um, good saying on you know, it, a good phrase on it. That's what I usually enjoy when I buy these. So this spoke to me. I like this one. Okay, I'm talking to my husband because he's talking in the background. background. He's motioning me saying he's fishing to go. So if you see me looking other than the camera, I'm looking at him because he says he's fixing to go take care of some business. All right. All right. Now, here is another mug, egg hunting. I guess this is like an Easter mug. Um, and this was like on sale for $3.50. I think that, no, I have not done it. I think the other one that I showed you like was an Easter mug or whatever. But I, I, I'll show you in a minute if I have not shown you. This is like egg hunting. This is like three dollars. I caught this three fifty. I caught this on sale um, after the after the Easter weekend or whatever, and they had it actually on sale. Actually, normally these was like five ninety nine, but it was on sale for three fifty. So this is very very good. Here, Carlisha. I guess this is gonna be vlogs. I mean vlog style style too because I'm talking to my daughter and to my husband too. Um, jelly beans. This was an Easter mug too. This was four dollars. Originally eight dollars. So I got this one at Home Goods. So I like this one very, very much. Okay. 
and I'm gonna decorate this for next year. Okay. And this one is I, this is one of my favorites. I like grab this one. This is like $5.99. Auntie. We are all, I think we have a bunch of aunties out there. Have a bunch of aunties out there. And um uh this one spoke to me as well. And it's all green on the inside or whatever, all green all over. So I like this one. So very, very good. Okay, the next one is a Easter mug, like Easter related, whatever. This is three dollars from Home Goods, and of course I got it after the Easter weekend or whatever. And it's like a shiny. It's a Love My Peeps, and it's shiny all over, and it's blue, not little little light blue color. Very very cute. I like this one too. It was three dollars. Three dollars. Um. So check check the. Check the um the, the sale rights, I mean the sale stands or whatever sale shelves after any um the holiday you may actually come up on some very very good deals. Um the next mug is like I found this one this weekend when I went on my daughter's birthday shopping trip. Um this was called this one is called Busy, and of course this is $9.99 and I'm a, I'm going to decorate this for summer. And this is very, very nice. I like this one. This one spoke to me as well because all the time, very, very busy. Very, very busy. And I'm going to be extremely busy since I'm going to be doing these YouTube videos. So I'm looking forward to it. I'm actually very, very excited to bring you so much content here on this channel. But again, this is Busy from Home Goods. Okay. And the next mug is a Easter mug and it says Peep Peep. And this is very cute too. It's all, it's like a shiny pink, and it's pink all over. And I just like this. And of course, this was three dollars um, Easter decor after the um, the weekend. I mean, after the holiday um, for Easter, and I got this on sale at Home Goods. Very very nice. Um, let me go ahead and finish all of the Easter decor. Then we can get into the other items. Let me hold that one, Carlisha. This is like a. This is like a. You won't, you won't believe how much this one costs. This one, I did that one. This one, this one was actually $7 from Home Goods. And it says hop to it. Seven bucks from Home Goods. I like to have jumped at the shelf when I saw this. I really, really do like this. So if you see, any of these items you thinking about decorating for next year pick them up very very good hop to it okay um another easter um related item that i got from home goods and i like to jump my i like to make a chef fall whenever i saw this one and i really really like this one it's called funny treats and it was I'm gonna see how much it was originally. Let's see. But they don't say how much it was originally. I don't know. Okay. Well, it probably was about 24 or something. But it was 15 bucks from Home Goods. I think it was about 24. But look how big it is. 15 bucks from Home Goods. And I caught this after the sale. I mean after the holiday. Bunny treats. Isn't that nice? Look at this. And it's got like very, very good suction on it. Look. Isn't that going to look pretty on my counter whenever I decorate next year for Easter? Very, very nice. I like it. So if you see these things, pick them up. And my next little Easter decor thing, it's not, it's not right done. But I thought it was cute. I can keep on the countertop and keep like Easter snacks in it or whatever whenever it's um, that holiday next year. And it was $4 from um, Home Goods. And it's just like a little canister. It's got good suction on it. It's got a little wood top. And it just snaps and it got like the bunny rabbit on this side and has a like, bunny rabbit on the other side. So that's cute to keep on your counter. And it was $4 if I didn't tell you before. Um, this. 
Let me do my last Easter decor thing. And this is like a, it, this is not right done. This is just like a um, little canister I got from Home Goods, And it was originally $13, but I got it for $6. And I thought I could just add it to my Easter decor whenever I get with the decorate next year for Easter. And just to put some things in it on my countertop. So I thought it was very, very cute. And again, this was $6 from Home Goods. Okay. And I think that is all the Easter decor. Um, I'm going to show you the, I guess, none Easter decor in my book that that I'm going to decorate for this summer. And I think I'm gonna put this um on my countertop pretty pretty soon. And I guess it's they, I guess they not put this out for Mother's Day because Mother's Day is coming up pretty soon this weekend actually on the eighth. So so soon. Okay. Um. This is Mom Snacks, and this was $19.99 from TJ Maxx. So, has very good, very good suction on it. Very, very good suction. And I'm going to enjoy this on my counter. I actually put like tea bags in here, or keep like cookies or snacks or anything for the kids in here. So, very, very good. But it's going to look nice on my counter. Like I said before. I use my storage containers. I don't just put them up there and don't use them. But I use those. Use these everywhere in my house. Um, this one says, bless the mom. Bless mom. Look, bless mom, mom snacks. I think I'm gonna put my mom snacks in here and tell them not to touch it. Mom snacks. Bless mom. $19.99, of course, from Home Goods. And I mean, no, not from Home Goods. I got this one from TJ Maxx. But look at that color on it. It looks like Easter, but this is like the collection for um, Mother's Day, I think. So, if you see that and you like it, pick it up. All right, next one. This I think this is my first black Radon mug. And I, I've just recently started, started collecting Radon. I think I started like about two years ago just just having like a small few items here and there but um not going overboard but i i mean i enjoy watching um other people rate on hauls not saying it's not, nothing wrong with going overboard but um i mean i would love to have their collection and just enjoy the some of the things that they have but i'm just starting off kind of um small of the things that speaks to me and this spoke to me mom fuel i don't drink um, caffeinated coffee. I drink decaf coffee or tea. I actually drink everything out of these cups, not just for coffee, hot tea, juice, you know, anything out of these cups. So, mom fuel. We all need a little bit of mom fuel in our life. So, very, very good. I like that one. Of course, it's 5 dollars from TJ Maxx, I think. And my last um, radon um, item is a planner like a planner it was $12.99 for like a plant so you can put a plant in it says blossom and I think I'm gonna put this on my porch or in my kitchen somewhere I'll put a um, plant in it and I'm just gonna um enjoy this for the throughout the summer season or whatever I guess you could use it for any type of season because if you put a plant in it we all hope that it blossoms and grows so it just don't have to be for the spring season or the summer season I guess it could be for any season, so I actually going to like this one as well. Whenever I put it on my countertop, I don't know if I'm going to, going to put it like a fake plant in it. I may try a real plant, but I'm looking forward to, forward to that and enjoying that. But if you see this one and you like it, pick it up. But of course, there's so many products, there's so many items out there for Radon that we we want and we just can't find it all the time. Whatever. I'm not a big Radon shopper. I just get the things that that I like so but of course like I said before I enjoy watching a lot of radon hauls and I just like those type of things and I, I, I forgot um, I have my daughter handed me a few more items um, and I forgot to share with you some some Easter items I think these are like hand towers and I got these from home goods and it says happy Easter I'm gonna put these in this is uh, going to go in my boys bathroom it says happy Easter and it's it's like really really in, in Broader, I can't say that big word, and broader on there, and it's very, very um, hard like or whatever. But you're 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 actually like that. I guess you can see a little bit how hard the um, 
the embroidery is on there. Very, very good quality, I think. And this one is yellow, and I'm put this in my bathroom. And it says Happy Easter, and it has the same kind of embroidery on there as the other one. So I thought it was really, really nice. And actually, they're very, very thick. Very, very thick. And I can't believe they had these at for five dollars and that was originally 10 but i guess that's like a good deal but um to me it was a really really good deal but it's i thought that this type of quality i thought it'd be much much more than ten dollars of, of the original price but it's actually very very good so i like that that's gonna be the end of my um video for today um I, re I have enjoyed doing this video with you guys and i just hope to come back here on youtube and just share with you guys a lot more um content as i'm um as i'm doing my channel and as i'm going trying to grow my channel so i just want to invite you guys along the process and i hope you guys join join me and be a part of my youtube family as i um go about this process I'm, of, of course i'm still learning here new on youtube but i just hope you guys like my content leave me some comments and we just i just want this to be a place that we as homemakers we as women even men can come to see new ideas that will help each other in our lives in our lives as we go about our busy lives whenever we get off from work sometimes we're stressed we don't know what things were we don't know what to cook for dinner we don't know what cleaning techniques to try we don't know what to um prepare for um for our kids the next day in regards to their wardrobe or um in order to sit down with the kids to do the homework what techniques works best so i'm going to bring you those ideas here on my channel not just cleaning my channel is called forever clean and we are forever cleaning but like i said in my description i'm going to bring you other exciting ideas not just cleaning um um not just cleaning videos i'm just going to bring you a lot of ideas that will help us as home homemakers help us as women to grow prosper to support each other and just um be a part of something here meaningful here on youtube so um i hope you guys join me next time see you